I don't give out AZZ, okay? Right. I don't want to pop the pistol. We both grown. We can talk out issues. But just in case you got too much bass, I'm going to bring two sticks like a popsicle. Yeah. The mag is big, but the Glock little. The bag is big, but the block little. Yeah. You niggas be rushing to die. Ah, I'm taking my time. I'm going to outlive yeah. you. You niggas be blowing the whistle off. Know everything like you see through a crystal ball. Know yeah. what they did and you know what they did to y'all. You know about every bitch in the city, y'all. Groupy yeah. ass niggas, I got to get rid of y'all. Play from a distance, won't be in the midst of y'all. Get to acting like bop if you piss me off. Ah, acting like bop if you piss me off. I'm about to wear your whiskey, y'all. Yeah. Huh. When I grab you by the whiskers and rip them all. Welcome to Big Boys Noise. Good evening, noisy neighbors. How you guys doing today? I am your teacher, Mr. Big Boy Noise. Or you can just call me Mr. Noise. And welcome to Parent Teacher Day. Yes, report cards are due. Report cards. Uh, marking periods are in. I've made my um, markings. And oh, wait a minute. You guys look familiar. Mr. Plastic. Miss Metal. Oh. Well, we don't discriminate here. I get where we going here now. A little mixture of metal, mixture of, mixture, mixture of plastic. Um, Mr. and Mrs. 2.0 Metal Competitor. How are you today? I'm doing just fine myself. Mr. and Mrs. 2.0 Metal Competitor, I'm assuming you're here to know about your child, how he's doing so far with this market period, right? Well, I just do love the comp. I, I see where you guys did it at the uh, Smith & Wesson factory. I like how you guys mesh together with the plastic and the whole metal situation you got going on there. It's a beautiful, uh, you know, display of... Um, Of oneness, <laughs> you know what I mean? Oh, your uh, son here is, um, so far he's new to the class, but he has been excellent. He is up to about 365 or 368 rounds. Um, only two failures to feed, or, well, two, um, yeah, failures to feed, basically, during the first 50 rounds out of the box of bone dry. So just two fighters to feed in the very beginning, but we now 365, 368 rounds in, and he's just just a great example to the class of coming together. It's not about being who's it's not about who's black, who's white. It's not about who's metal, who's plastic. It's about hi, hey, hey, what's wrong with coming together here for one common cause and getting a serious job done, okay? That's what uh, M&P 2.0 did with this thing here. Um, I'm in love with five-inch barrels, okay? I mean, I always like to say that your son here has a bit of an old soul. When I say a bit of an old soul, because um, the guns of the 80s and the 90s coming up, you know, especially during the 80s, me being a little bit of an 80s baby, born in the late 70s and the 80s, you know what I mean? I'm in my 40s, but um, coming up, a metal gun, a steel gun was a man's gun. You know what I mean? And um, what I love about it is you're getting the feel of a, a man's gun, steel gun. But like um, the song James Brown said, this is a man's world, but it wouldn't be nothing without a woman's touch. You get that woman's touch, a beautiful finesse looking grip here with great texture of plastic, okay? It's like, it's like the best of both worlds. It's like the best of both worlds, okay? And that's what this gun has been. Running nine millimeter. I mean, you're getting mags, 17 plus one. I love the metal mags, okay? The fast release, when you push that mag release button there, that extended mag release there. Look how fast she drops her backpack. You know what I mean? How she fast she takes her, her homework book out. You know what I mean? Um, this, uh... It's just a wonderful 9mm, and I'm not going to take too much time, guys. The, I really like what you guys did with the lightning cut slides. Makes it easy for purchase, okay? Easy for purchase. 
Like I said, I'm in love with five inch barrels, come with a metal still, a still guide ride. Um, never forgets to bring its own ink pen to class, never forgets to bring its pencils. A very prepared firearm is this Smith & Wesson 2.0. And I'm gonna let you know, with 368 rounds fired through it, only two failures to feed, and, I'm, and I've still been running it bone dry out of the box. This market period, we're going to give it a, 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 a really, really, really solid, a really solid B plus. I don't give out A's easy. Okay. A solid B plus. And I'm figuring by next market period, by next market period, a little more um, homework time together, by next market period, you know, I'm sure it'll be getting an A, an A grade, but, um. Yeah, you got a B plus. You have got to have nothing to do but be proud of your son, the Smith and Wesson 2.0. You guys continue to do the um, the oneness thing. All right. All right. Nice meeting you. All right. Yeah. Um, you can email me anytime, and I'll give you feedback, and um, I'll keep you abreast like that. All right. All right. Now you have a good good one. Oh, and next time, don't forget to bring an apple. <laughs> Hey, how you guys doing there? I know whose mom and dad you are. How you guys, man? How you been, man? Mr. X? Mrs. D? Mr. and Mrs. Springfield XD, huh? <laughs> well, you guys already know your son here has been wonderful in my class for a very, very, very long time. Very consistent, very trustworthy, I call him like uh, one of my favorite students, uh, the perfect example for the class. He is the crossing guard. You ever know, you know, everybody go to school, you have your regular students, and then you have your student that is not just good in class, but before school starts, you see him, he's out there at the bus stop with his arms like this, with the crossing guard, the glowing um orange or green, lime green band across his chest, and he's stopping all the kids at the red light, then he's putting his hands down so they could go, then he's stopping them. He's like a model student, you know what I mean? Because of that safety grip he got, he's very safe, especially for newbies, first time, um, Students to the class, first time handlers, that safety grip is a very safe uh, contraption. He's very durable to come with, to be a Springfield, coming with a steel guide ride. Um, he comes with mags of 13. He could go flush with 13 plus one, which is 14 rounds, very concealable. Just a three inch barrel, but if you guys look at some of my videos, this three inch barrel is not your normal three inch barrel. All right, guys, Springfield XD. From 20 yards, from 20. The three inch barrel with two bullseyes and one kind of nick shot, where it kind of nicked it there, but two beautiful bullseyes. So very high performing. 3.3 uh, three inch barrel, okay? But um, yeah, you got the, for flesh fitting and concealment, you can go 13 plus one with the mag, or you can get the, um, it comes also with these mags here, which give you, look at that, more of a, little more to grab onto, which makes it 16 plus one, 16 plus one, rounds of nine millimeter and that's plenty to get get somebody up off of you you know what i mean i mean this kid here he's just um there's not enough i can say about him mr x and mrs d okay um there's not enough i mean there's not enough uh words that i could say about him i mean there's not enough there's not enough space in the report card comment section for all the good things i have to say about your son here Little boy XD, little man, little man, man, you know, and um, you guys know it's always shortest to tallest. Shortest is always in the front of the line, so it's just so fitting for him to be one of my favorite students because he's always up under me, you know what I mean? And he never forgets to bring me an apple. <laughs> yeah, guys, I'm going to greet him, the Springfield XD. Your son has done well. We're going to greet him with a A plus. We're going to greet him with an A plus. Yes, A plus.
one of our honor roll students. Yeah, he's one of the ones. All right, you guys have a good day. And you keep on doing such a great job. All right now. Uh-oh, guys. Who's that I see coming through the rotating doors? Speaking of rotation, it's Mr. and Mrs. to 412 with the rotating tubes. How are you guys doing today? Yes, I'm your son's teacher, Mr. Noise, or you can call me Big Boy Noise. Yes, let me tell you, your son is amazing. In fact, he's special. Um, your son has a thing called special ed, you know, special education. This Tavor 12 will give out a special education to anyone who needs it. Yo. That could fit the whole shotgun through his mouth. Look at this. Come out here, look. On this side. He just fit the whole shotgun through his whole <laughs> mouth. With the dog on sights up. Jeez. Listen, guys, double our buck. Come on, get it on me. Double, double our buck, guys, is a powerful thing. The Tavor 12. It's just a wonderful shot. Yes, yes, yes. A little bit of ADHD. Feels like you always got to be fidgety and doing something. You know what I mean? But let me tell you something. He really gets the job done. I don't know if you guys know um, Mr. and Mrs. Uh, Tavor 12. There was a basketball player. A lot of times, um, let's just say he gets dumb with it. So sometimes he needs a little, you know, not saying you got to be dumb to be a special ed, but he himself gets dumb with it. You ever heard of athletes who don't really pay much attention to the books, but somehow they get into college and they get that, that scholarship and they get to that NBA team. Somehow all of a sudden somebody comes and do their test for them. Well, it's kind of like that Shaq effect, just a big dominant dunker. If you ever thought about Shaq breaking backboards, well, that's what your son is, okay? Tavor 12, special ed, special ed, breaking backboards, hardcore. I mean, such an athlete, so dominant that it's like, um, we're going to pass him through. Keep it on. Keep it recording. He's clear. He's smoking, baby. Whoa. Whoa. Let's go check him out. Look. Smoking, baby. I love it. Check him out, though. Well, guys, he used to have... How's he going to eat his food? Shake my hand. Whoa. <laughs> so, uh, if I'm honest with you on his report card... It doesn't even matter what his greed says. It only matters what reality says. And let me tell you something, in the real world, this 12 gauge shotgun has over 500 rounds th ran through it now with only two failures to feed. And they, well, no, one stove pipe and one failure to feed. And that was all the way back in the very break-in um, break period. That was during like the first off. Uh, 50 rounds, two failures of feet, but ever since that, you're talking 500 rounds of 12 gauge. Pardon my French, there's other teachers, there's other students here, I don't want to say. 12 gauge kick ASS. Okay? But yeah, special education. He gives a special education, and he is very disruptive, very loud, like the Mossberg 500 shotgun. Um, sometimes I pair them together in a group and I let them make all the noise they want as long as they're not bothering other kids. Um, another one of those firearms that doesn't like much help just wants you to give him his assignment and get out of his way. One thing about him, he would, it might be messy. He might not have the neatest handwriting. That double out buck might spread all over the notebook paper and really do some damage. A little wild, hard to count the group in. But let me tell you something. He gets it done. Okay. Be, listen, you be proud of your son because I'm going to tell you what I'm going to give him. I'm going to give him an A+. Plus. On a roll. <laughs> and believe it or not, 
Uh, if he's not sh bursting the pumpkin, he's bringing me an apple. You guys, <laughs> you guys have a good one. I'm gonna get out of here now. All right. All right. Maybe I have enough. Maybe I, if I get out of here fast enough, there might be enough time for a range trip. <laughs> yes. Yeah, nice to meet you, Mister and Mrs. Tavor Twelve Shotgun. Big boy noise, Mister Noise. Until next time, everybody. Your boy, Big Boy Noise. This has been Parent Teacher Day. Get ready for part three of Parent Teacher Day. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And if any of you guys are owners of the Smith & Wesson 2.0, Springfield XD, or the 412 gauge shotgun, you put your comments and um, give me your grades on the firearm in the, in the comment box. Until next time, guys. Y'all stay up.